Aphids may appear on any kind of plant, from indoor flower to giant tree. During a season, an insect colony can cause serious damage to both the plants and the future crop. Therefore, a whole range of safe means is used against pests. Nowadays, more than 4,000 species of aphids are known, and about 1,000 of them live in Europe. This insect not only has a huge appetite, but also is a carrier of dangerous viruses that cause anomalies in plants. Aphids multiply very quickly and occupy the garden beds in a matter of days. Cucumbers, cabbage, legumes and pumpkin crops suffer from its invasion the most. The growth of young shoots slows down, fruit formation decreases, and then plants wither and die. Aphid control methods. There are quite a few ways to confront aphids, but not all of them are safe for plants and humans, and even fewer are actually effective. So the first step is to use the methods that don't harm the environment. In addition, it's better to use the ones that don't require quarantine periods before harvesting. Don't forget to fight garden ants. They usually appear at the same time with aphids. Keep in mind that attracting birds and helpful insects or planting repellent plants is used only for prevention, but not for extermination of pests. Ladybugs and lacewings will not be able to cope with multiple aphid colonies. Some gardeners advise planting fragrant flowers and herbs in the beds, like dill, marigolds or mint. However, these plants are also susceptible to aphid attacks so they cannot serve as 100% protection. We recommend you to pay attention to safe aphid control methods that actually work. Fighting aphids using folk remedies. Aphids feed on the sap of young leaves and branches, since they are not able to pierce rigid leaf plate with their proboscis. If we treat young plant with aggressive chemicals, we risk damaging the delicate shoots. Therefore, it's better to turn to time-tested folk methods of dealing with aphids. Water. Use ordinary water if you need to get rid of aphids on plants with dense, tough leaves. Douse bushes and tall plants with water under pressure from a hose to make the insects fall down to the ground. They cannot climb back themselves, only be dragged by ants. Give such a summer shower to the plants regularly, until the pests disappear completely. Aphid Soap Solution Add 4 or 5 tablespoons of dish detergent, washing powder, liquid or laundry soap to 1 liter of water. It is better to use soap without strong fragrances, since their smell attracts pests, which is not in line with our goals. Nevertheless, tar soap with its pungent aroma can be quite effective. Dissolve a bar of soap 100 grams, in 10 liters of water and use a spray bottle to treat the plants with the liquid you made. Anti-aphid soap and soda mixture. Add one quarter of bar of grated laundry soap and one tablespoon of potash to one liter of warm water. If you use soda without soap, it will quickly wash off under the influence of precipitation and the composition will have to be applied again. Ash infusion for fighting aphids. Stir a glass of wood ash in 5 liters of water, leave it for 12 hours, and then spray it over the affected beds. This is one of the most effective aphid control methods. Tobacco infusion against aphids on plants. You will need a glass of strong tobacco leaves or just cigarette butts. Brew tobacco in 5 liters of boiling water, leave for a day and then sieve. The solution turns out to be quite concentrated, so don't apply it to plants before harvesting. It will be possible to harvest the fruits no earlier than a week after processing. Infusion of zest. Take a half liter jar of dried citrus fruit peels, grind the peels and soak them in 1 liter of water for 24 hours. Then boil it for 10 minutes, sieve and pour into a bucket of water, 10 liters. For the best effect, you can add 1 tablespoon of liquid soap to the solution. Spicy herbal infusions against aphids. Aphids don't tolerate spicy foods. Horseradish, garlic and hot peppers help to get rid of this insect without unnecessary trouble. Fill a container with chopped roots and leaves of horseradish by a third and add boiling water to the top. Let it brew for 24 hours. Cut one or two pods of hot pepper into pieces, add a liter of boiling water and let brew for several hours. Garlic infusion is more difficult to prepare. Crush or chop a large head of garlic into small pieces and brew in one liter of boiling water. When the liquid cools down, add two tablespoons of any detergent or soap and two tablespoons of vegetable oil to it. An infusion of celandine is effective against aphids. Take 3 to 4 kilograms of raw herb, whole plant, or 1 kilogram of dry herb per 10 liters of water. Let it brew for 1 or 2 days, then sieve and add soap. 
Infusion of tomato or potato tops. Chop the tops of tomato and or potatoes into small pieces. Take a container with a volume of for example 3 liters, fill it for a half with the chopped tops and pour boiling water to the brim. Let it brew for 24 hours and then add 1 tablespoon of soap or washing powder. Onion infusion against aphids. Pour 1 liter of water into 30 to 35 grams of chopped onion heads. You can also add some onion husk and leave for 5 hours. After this, add 4 to 5 grams of laundry soap. Save the infusion and bring its volume to 1 liter. Pine infusion. Pour 4 liters of boiling water into 1 kilogram of pine needles. Leave it for 7 days, but remember to stir every day. Before spraying, dilute the infusion with water at a 1 to 1 ratio. Sorrel against aphids. Pour 10 liters of hot water into 300 grams of horse sorrel roots and leave for 2 to 3 hours. Then spray over the plants. Flower infusions against aphids. To prepare chamomile infusion, pour 1 liter of boiling water into 100 grams of dry stems and inflorescences of chamomile and leave for 12 hours. Add 4 grams of soap to the infusion. Before spraying, dilute the liquid with water at a 1 to 3 ratio. Dandelions also do a good job with aphids. Brew 400 grams of leaves and 200 grams of roots of flowering dandelions for 3 to 4 hours in 10 liters of water. Then spray the plants with the resulting infusion. Essential oils against aphids. Dissolve 10 to 15 drops of lavender, tea tree, cedar and thyme essential oils in 100 milliliters of cream. Add 2 cups of water and spray the plants with the resulting mixture 2 times a day. You will surely see excellent results in just 3 days. All these infusions and mixtures are usually sprayed in the evening. Plants should be treated abundantly until the affected areas are completely wetted. Try to get the solution on the lower surface of leaves to areas with large concentrations of aphids. In the majority of cases, the pests disappear after a few treatments with home methods. However, if the plants are in a critical condition, then it's more advisable to use industrial insecticides.